Dan Bell, uh, Bell certified uh, as we continue to speak about the MPEP at 706.02F1. We're speaking about 35 USC 102E1 and the nine examples that are found at this section of the MPEP. And let's take a look and see uh, this example, what it has in store for us. Notice uh, you have an international uh, application that's filed. And this is the first one we've seen that's filed before this critical date that we've learned. Um, and so this is going to be an old it's going to be an old 102e example. And so we'll be looking for a 371 C124 date in the fax. That'll be our 102e date, but only on a patent. It won't apply to the pubs. Um, okay, let's see what we have. Um, so we have a international application filed. It designated the U.S. Uh, it, it published, oh, word published. 102A. Um, any language? Well, under the old version, we, we're just looking for this state. We don't care about what language. Um, published uh, by WIPO um, in any language is okay. We have a nat. Oh, here's our date right here. This is our 102E date. But only if we have a patent. Let's look if we have a patent. Oh, we do. Here's our patent. And our publication has no meaning. Uh, so that's the story of one o the old 102e. Um, so you have an event here. This is a this uh, this would just be a 102e date. There's no one and two in the old version. There's just 102e, um, and um, it's it's that's the event here, and the date it gets is entitled to is th is this date here, which is is the C124 date. Uh, so let's see. Uh, the 102e date for the pub is none. We've got no no pub no uh, on the WIPO pub nothing, uh, the U.S. pub nothing, uh, and then let's see what we got, and then for the for the patent it'd be the one o is this date here this July first, two thousand two that's right, uh, and then let's look and see what uh, they have to say about the international application. Uh, the international application publication by WIPO can be applied under A and B. Yeah, that's always true, right? Once it's and so with the issued uh, patent uh, under A and B, it's uh, it's just that uh, this date's later um, for the issued patent. Uh, you can get back to the uh, to this date under E. So uh, that's the benefit of E. Uh, let's look at the next statement. If the international application properly claimed the benefit of an any earlier filed U.S. application, there still would be no 102E one date, no pub dates. Uh, for the WIPO applications, for the U.S. and WIPO applications, and the 35102E date will be still be July 1st, uh, the date these requirements are fulfilled. So, um, so if you had an earlier filed um, U.S. application here, say on this date, they're saying that um, you wouldn't be able to get back behind uh, this date here to this earlier filed US application uh, based on this uh, based on this issue here you're only titled to this 102 e date let's look at the next statement if if a later filed US non-provisional claimed the benefit of the international application the 102 e date of the application publication of the later filed would be its actual filing date in the US and the e date of the patent of the later application would be the same. Um, let's look and see what they're talking about there. So before this grants, if you have a filing date here of a U.S. a U.S. filing date here, whoops, and it's claiming back to the, um, it's trying to claim back to these U.S. I'm sorry, yeah, international application um, and then it later maybe it publishes here and then it issues here boom 102a 102b date but what about can we get back and it's so it's saying that um, on the um, on the publication you can get back to the US filing date here um, 
and because pubs don't work under one old 102e pubs don't matter it's only the new US filing date th that you can get to here under the pub and under the issued patent you know on the, the second date here once this event happens of the patent being issued that um, that it is entitled to this earlier 102e date here which is this uh, C124 date see what uh, the next statement says. If the patent was based on a later filed US application, the claim the benefit of the international application and the later filed US application filing date is before the date of the 35 USC were fulfilled, if fulfilled at all, the 102A date of the patent would be the filing date of the later filed US application that claim the benefit of the international. So this is just a variance of the previous example. They're saying that if if there was a US application filed here before but oops before the before the C one two four date, if you had it here, then this would be a filing date for pub oops uh reasons. Um you you know and it also said you're claiming benefit to back here, this international filing date. Um it would be this U.S. filing date for uh, pub. Um, let's go back and see what it said. Third point: If the patent was based on a U.S. application to claim the benefit of the international application, and the later f U.S. filing date is before the C124 date, um, the date of the patent would be the filing date of the later. US application. So it's saying that that you're entitled to this date um for the um for both the patent and the publication. So you know, when this thing later published here or issued here, um this event this would be a we 102 event this would be a, a uh, 102E2 event. This is an E1 event, and you're entitled to this this state here. So, um, another way to look at that is um, you always, you know, f you're always entitled to a U.S. Uh, filing date. If it's an actual U.S. filing date, that's what 102E is. E is, and so you can get back to that. Um, if you're trying to get back to an earlier date, uh, it's it, it's only if it's a PCT app application that you're trying to get through to, to an earlier date. And that was, for example, in this example, where the U.S. application was filed here, you would get this date. But the rule says that if 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 um, that you can get to this C124 date, which is earlier. In this case, since this is earlier, there's no reason, you know, to to try to use the to, to get back through the international filing date so for both the pub and the um, the patent on example 6 is what that uh, what that statement saying there okay um, boy these are going slow uh, so that's complete 6 uh, and uh, the next video I'll talk about 7 thanks